I just need to know how Darby would do this. I mean, I know what Darby would do. He would put in one of those cool slow motion scenes of him clearing this successfully. But I'm not Darby. Hey everyone, this is Lair from Lair Gaming, and today I'm going to be playing some of your levels that you submitted to Darby at Blue Television Games, and uh, hopefully help him clean up his backlog a little bit and get current again. We're starting with Half Minute Hellfire, Very Hard, by user named Alex. Okay, so it's a one screen with red coins and a lot of death. Uh, okay. Oh, perfect. Do I see another red coin in the top left? I think that's the one I'm going for second. Didn't even see that pow block up there. Once we get those two, we go to where that muncher is. I feel like I'm going way too slow. Whoa, I can't believe we made that. I also didn't know I could jump on those. Oh, what? Wow. Okay, so when you're climbing up that vine, you have to turn left and right to match the movement of those potobos. You know what? I bet that this takes exactly 30 seconds. I feel like the clear rate would be higher than it is if it... Ooh, man, that's tough. There's even a checkpoint over there. I don't think it does anything. I guess if you ran out of time, but you got the checkpoint, then you would come back at the checkpoint and fall right on the... on the axe. I just need to know how Darby would do this. I mean, I know what Darby would do. He would put in one of those cool slow motion scenes of him clearing this successfully. But I'm not Darby. After we get past that, I don't feel like we're gonna have any problem with the rest of it. I mean, 10 seconds at the end of that section seems like more than enough to finish. You know, because we can see the rest of the level pretty much. We did it! Oh, we gotta wait, though. Oh, okay, I didn't anticipate this. I think it's okay, though. I think it's okay. I think we got it. Okay, six, five, four, three, two. Oh, no. Oh, wow, that was horrific. I did not know what was gonna happen. I thought we were coming out further to the right. We went through that locked door, and we would have to hit that POW block and then get to the axe with one second left on the timer. Amazing. Wow. Thanks so much, Alex. I really appreciate the level. I was nowhere near the world record of 23 seconds. Uh, I actually only had 0.14 seconds left before I would have timed out. Uh, that was really, really cool. All right, next up, I'm going to be playing Hypertonic Mario by Hechez. Uh, I think that this level is probably a little bit above my skill ceiling, but uh, I'm just going to really push myself and see what happens. This has like a 0.4% clear rate. Okay. Perfect. Great start. Okay, so there's a bomb over to the right. Okay, so that looks like a spin jump. So maybe I should just start from here, spin jumping. Okay. Koopa goes into the lava. All right, all right, all right. So 
here, Koopa, bomb, bomb. What do I do with this? Throw, <laughs> Yoshi, ah, oh, fire bar. Okay, this is crazy. Yoshi, what, ah, oh, blah. That was awful. So, oh, that's not good. Whoa, whoa, a checkpoint, a checkpoint. Oh my goodness, there's a checkpoint in this level. How is the clear rate so low if there's a checkpoint in the level? Oh my goodness, if there are two checkpoints in this level, I might cry a little bit. Okay, gotta time that a little bit better. And we will, maybe. It's okay, it's okay. Oh, no it's not. Okay. Oh, that was good. Okay, well, we couldn't grab the Yoshi for whatever reason. And we definitely have to have the Yoshi. Oh, we're doing something. Run. Run, 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 run. Oh, subworld. We are in subworld. Oh, whoa. Power ups. <laughs> it's like, what's going on here? Getting power ups in a very difficult level oh we did it that's it that's all this level is how is that possible how is it possible for that clear rate to be that low on a very very easy level i honestly have no idea why that clear rate is so low i'm gonna get the world record on this right now oh okay we got it easy peasy thanks so much hey Chez. that was really really unexpected thanks man last up for me today is a level called speedy spins and triple jumps by lee I got to meet Lee the other day in a live stream and play one of his levels for the first time, and it was incredible. Really easily, uh, I could tell that Lee was going to be one of my favorite new creators. All right. That was a bad start. That was a really bad start. So let's... Okay. Right, spin jumps. I'm thinking that I'm either going to be doing... Triple jumps or spin jumps this whole time, and I shouldn't try to complicate that. Oh, no. <laughs> that was really a mistake. Oh, wow. All right, I'm pretty bad at this, apparently. Whoa. Whoa, I accidentally did that. Oh, blah. <laughs> That level was getting away from me quick. I didn't even know what I was doing there. Insane. Oh no. Oh, we slowed down a lot. We're not gonna make this. There was no way we were gonna make that. It seems like Lee has made a pretty great dash level here. I played one the other day that was, <laughs> it challenged me. Honestly, it was very, very tough. It had about a second left on the timer at the very end, and that was if you went 100% full speed through the whole level. It was just so hard. Uh... 
All right, I wasted some time there, but I made a mistake. Oh, come on. Come on, me. Pull it together. No! Oh, that's just sad. One thing that Lee has done really well here is implement all of these coin trails. I mean, dash levels in particular really kind of need those, especially if the player is put in a position where he needs to know what to do immediately. The coins really help it be a little closer to second nature than otherwise. There we go. Nice. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. It was raining power-ups and Yoshis there at the end. Very cool. Thanks so much, Lee. Thank you so much to Darby and Laura Lee at Blue Television Games for welcoming me so freely into the BTG family and allowing me to be a guest here today. I'd also like to extend a huge thank you to everyone for watching this and getting to know me a little bit. I'm really looking forward to the opportunity to get to know everyone even better. I've been Lair from Lair Gaming, and take care, guys.